The world of fashion is ever present, so for those who want to break into the industry, it is possible. And lucky for you, we are here with our very own fashion expert, Old Jay Goulson. Good morning, Old Jay. Good morning. So some people get their start as an intern, maybe as a fashion apprentice, or even mm. a reality TV show contestant. How did you get your start in fashion? Um, I always had a big passion for fashion, and it took me a lot of hard work and very much discipline to get where I am today. And you know as a very young girl. I was four. I was cu cutting up my mom's dresses because I was obsessed with the Jean-Paul Gaultier look. <laughs> Who so, was it? Yes, definitely. <laughs> and then straight after I graduated, I decided to just go for it and create my own brand. But you do have to have a really good business mind for it. It's not all parties and glamour and cocktails and fashion magazines. It's far from, actually. It's a lot of hard work, and you have to like be very disciplined, willing to do anything. I've carried so much boxes full of merchandise in my life. It's like ridiculous. It's far from being like all glammy and all dolled up going to parties. Because if that's what you want to do, please don't start. <laughs> You do have to get somebody coffee when you initially start, I assume, right? Yeah, you have to be willing to just do anything. Keep your goal in mind and just work really hard to achieve it. And don't expect overnight success. I think sometimes, especially with the reality TV shows, people think, well, that's easy. I can do that. Yeah, it seems to be kind of a standard uh, right now that people think if I'm a little bit of famous, I can just sell my own perfume and have my own brand. But I think, you know, it takes a lot of creativity to do something on the long term. So I think that's what you should be aiming for is creating something that will last 10, 20, 30 years. So stay committed to your goal. Definitely. And don't let anybody try and persuade you. No, I think a lot of people always will come at you and tell you what to do, but I think a big part of uh, success in the industry is to really be very loyal to your own handwriting and your own identity. Great advice. Just head to our website for more information.